Fui a Costa Rica por mi vacación. Tomamos el avión a la Alajuela Airpuerto. El Airpuerto está muy abaratado. It has a $75 million operating budget. It is self-supporting enterprise with revenues coming from landing fees, rents, concessions, and other fees. It is open 24 hours a day, 365 days a year. Yo que darse a el centro turístico y balneario. Tome en el sol y descanse. También comi comida increíble. It is a tropical paradise of 24 individually designed villas nested on a 40-acre plantation in the central valley of Costa Rica. It has an elevation of 3,900 feet and a temperature of 70 degrees Fahrenheit. Fui a Arino Volcano Primero en mi viaje a Costa Rica. La camina está muy largo. Fui una mariposa con ojos en las ajas. El insecto está interesante. It is an active anti-cytic stratovolcano. It last erupted in 2010. It has a 5,479 feet of elevation. It suddenly erupted in 1968 at 7 in the morning and lasted several days. It killed 87 people and buried three villages. Después, fui el Teatro Nacional de Costa Rica. Vi el juego, Romeo y Juliet. Es muy bueno. El teatro es muy grande y bonito. It opened in 1897 and it was designed by an architect named Roy Cristoforo Malinali. It is said it is illuminated against the sky. Two statues, one of Spanish dramatist Calderón de la Barca and famous composer Beethoven, lay in front of the theater. Después, fui al Museo de los Niños. Ahí estas muchas exhibiciones interesantes. Quiere a montar en el helicóptero, pero no puede. It is a science and culture center. It is one of the oldest buildings in the capital and is easy to find because it looks like a castle. It opened in 1994 and it contains the largest art gallery in the country. En mi terminar último, fui a Iglesia de la Inmaculada. La iglesia es largo y muy bonita. It was built around 1806, but the exact date is unknown, and it was consecrated in 1704. It was reconstructed in 1851 after an earthquake destroyed it. Baptistry and catechism school was added, and the gardens were enlarged. The temple shows simple, whitewashed Spanish neoclassical exterior while humility and faith of the people who constructed it in the interior.